So, Yamagishi, do you sense anything? No. By refusing to speak, you're only hurting yourself. We aren't keeping you here because we hate you. We just want to avoid unnecessary confrontation. House Chidori. Again? What's your obsession, Junpei? Did she say anything? Not a word. Can I just talk to her? Iori, it seems like you're letting your emotions get the best of you. Is everything okay? Well, not exactly. I know she attacked me, but I can't stop thinking about her. Junpei-kun. Sheesh. Hmm. Desperate times call for desperate measures, I suppose. All right, try and talk to her. Got it! You okay? I'm glad they let you keep your sketchbook. <laughs> You're still drawing pictures, even in the hospital. You really do like to draw, huh? It doesn't matter. She spoke. No one else but me can understand my pictures. Chidori! Your arm! Again? Fuka, get a doctor! Right away! Why are you bleeding? She does it to herself. No, I thought I'd removed all the sharp objects in here. She did this to herself? Apparently, we can't leave her unattended for even one moment. But fortunately, she heals at an astounding rate. Let go of me! Then, at the station, you did that to yourself? I never asked for your help. You were the one who misunderstood. Well, I want you to stop. You can't be doing that. It's not right. And I won't let you. The doctor will be here soon. You two should go now. Yeah. So, you seem to have found your voice. Yeah. <laughs> 
Hey. Yo, Chitterita. Don't call me that. Come on, cheer up. I brought you a new sketchbook. I thought your old one might be getting full. That wasn't necessary, Junpei. <laughs> you said my name. I was worried I'd never hear that again. <sighs> Any luck? She finally started talking, but nothing useful yet. Well, that's a start. So, why are you here? Chidori, what's what's wrong? Oh. Oh. I get the feeling there's something in here. Is it an enemy? Wrong! Get out of the way! <laughs> Chidori! Relax. Her persona just went berserk. It happens. It happens? Were you guys not watching at all? You could see for a second that her persona was strangling her. They're not like us. They can't fully control their personas. That's why they need to take suppressants to keep their personas from killing them. Suppressants? You know about Strega? You'd be surprised what you can learn on the streets. I'll give the doc the right pills. The rest is up to you. Shinji, wait! Hey! Junpei? Oh, thank God. I thought you might be. Why do you look so scared? Death is nothing to be afraid of. What are you saying? Dying just means you don't wake up anymore. That's all. What? You don't really mean that, do you? Junpei? I don't want you to die, Chidori. Junpei. Just because you're not afraid doesn't mean no one else is. Did you ever think about how I might feel? <laughs> you're so weird, Junpei. <laughs> Look who's talking. Hey, wait! Shinji! What the hell's going on? Why did you have those pills? I've heard about those. They're taken to suppress a persona when the user can't control it. But the side effects... <sighs> You're not taking them, are you? <sighs> Answer me! I don't owe you anything. <sighs> the same as always. Save it. I've heard it all before. You think I'm wasting my power, but you're just too thick-headed. I'm tired of your damn preaching. <sighs> Ow! Don't you get it? You know the reason. Ten years ago, my sister, the fire, I wasn't strong enough to save her. They held me back while she... That's why I try so hard. We promised, remember? to become strong enough to do what we think is right. 
So why the drugs? Why didn't you come talk to me? I'm back in the fight now, so let it go. <sighs> and then the side effects? <sighs> There's something I need to take care of. It's something only I can do. Like what? Listen, don't worry about me. Just do what you think is right. Shinji.
Welcome back. Oh, 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 oh. 